Hello everyone! Welcome back to this game. When we last left off, we broke up the bachelor party, and kind of think of it, I thought for some reason that coming in here I would find the third soda popper, but we've already found all three soda poppers. But anyway, yeah, we have broken up Lincoln's bachelor party, which will probably be helpful for some reason. Sybil's the only one for me. Not monster strippers, no. I hope you've given up the degrading exotic dancing career. Yes, I suppose now I just have to let this body go to waste. Cheer up, dude. You'll find another use. Have you finally come to your senses, Flint? Somebody put a Mickey Finn in the happy juice, Sam, and I'm gonna find out who. Right after my head stops pounding. Does this mean... It does mean we no longer have two pages of inventory because that uh, knowledge of truth stuff was used up. Awesome. Oh, what have I done? Oh, if the paparazzi catches me wearing not but a scarf, I must, I must contact wardrobe immediately. Don't, don't feel too bad. You got feathers. And Jimmy's got fur. Oh, I don't feel so good. I mean, there was a time when they didn't have fur, but he, he he's not in that phase anymore. Don't look at me! You're kind of hard to miss. So, I wonder what we'll do now. Well, I suppose I could finish looking around the room. With a cryogenic freezer, the party never has to stop. I wonder what they're keeping in the freezer these days. Oh, I hope it's not the body of the last stripper. It's a cooler full of punch. What do you know? T-H-E-M really were listening. Is this the last we'll see of Bosco's paranoia? That would be something. I hate it when people can't be bothered to keep their conspiracy plots current. Hey, some new squiggles. Way to go, Robo. There's nothing in here I want to see any closer. I think we broke it. Never use an enlarger with a stripper in the room. Whee! I guess that ain't Penang they're drinking. This place is a dive. Dive. No bombs here, unless you count this party. <laughs> this place is a dive. I don't get. I don't get it. No new weenies, but that's nothing new. I hope Bosco's remembering to separate his recyclables. Hey, why aren't there any new magazines? And don't give me the old I was in hell excuse. I was in hell! He told you not to give him that! Nothing's worse for a hangover than an X-ray light board. Maddie is saying that's a periscope. Well, yeah, it's a periscope, but what does it mean by this place is a dive? A dive is a cheap hole in the wall type bar. Oh, cheap hole in the wall type bar. Okay. See, I don't ever go to bars, so I wouldn't know. So anything else in here? Guess not. Although I didn't look at those pictures. I should look at those pictures on the wall. Maybe he'll actually explain them. Man, I need a better agent. I can't even get into surveillance photos these days. Nope, that's all we get. Okay, so what is next on the to-do list? So far we have not stopped any of the devilish soda poppers. And one of the rats just slipped down the hole, but I guess he did that on purpose. At, at first I thought his physics were just weird. So, earlier, Bearforce suggested that I use the Boxing Betty remote on Mametron here. That worked before, so might as well try it again. 
get him away from Jimmy for some reason. Here I go again on my own. I don't know what this will accomplish. But maybe we can get a song reference from Satan. He's a man of wealth and taste. That's not a one, that's not a song that I'm familiar with. That's here to remind you of the mess you left when you went away. Shout, shout, shout at the devil. Anything else? Anything else in the window is another question. Oh, we didn't check the manhole before. That leads to a land down under, where women glow and men plunder. No, you're never gonna get it. Hello? Is there anybody in there? They're just too shy shy. Dust in the wind. All we are is dust in the wind. I don't see any use for this, no. It's funny to think that that train station has been right under the street all these years. Who knew we were so close to hell? Literally speaking. Is there a reason we want to go back down there? Let's check it out real quick. Maybe we maybe we can talk to Harry. He might be helpful. Oh, well, he's not here. And Bosco's body is no longer here. Want to give us a hand? You just want to steal our secrets. Oh yeah, the zen of being squinty and impotent continues to elude us. I didn't think the game was that bad. Games based on a license are never a good business decision. Looks like the bottom dropped out of the Esperanto literature business. I wonder if there's a reason we want to go back into hell. Well, let me think here. First things first. We need to find spare ribs. Where are we going to find spare ribs? Unless... Oh, I just realized that the soul train and the train door are two separate objects. I'll have to check that later. Maybe we can get some ribs down here. I'm sure somebody might have a rib to give us. I mean, they're all dead, right? Hmm. Hey, SCP. Blah! Keep up the good work. Blah. I just noticed how he changes it away from Mime Sweeper as soon as he's afraid to get caught. That's kind of clever. Hey, buddy. Later, Hugh Bliss. Hi, Brady. Yes. So not only did the poppers beat you in the ratings, they beat you to death. Wow, you just gotta laugh. I said laugh. <laughs> Later, Brady. <clears throat> well, we got something new out of that anyway. Is there any ribs of any sort in here? Microwave, coffee pot... Where are we going to get rid? I do love my job. Was that a hint? I feel like that should have been a hint, but I wouldn't know what a hint for. Is it an outdated hint? Human skulls, 50 count. The only place here that's room temperature. I have no idea where we could get ribs. Well, here's the office diorama. Should I be disturbed that my personal hell was my own office? Wait. 
Satan's grocery list. I wonder if we can give that to somebody. And they would go away. Well, first things first. Can I find ribs in here anywhere? It's just for show. But what a show it is. No. Let me go ahead and turn the hint system box back up. Get more hints. So we'll head on back out then, I guess. Also, look at the train. Because we haven't done that. Yikes, don't touch that. It's hotter than a third rail at rush hour. But you went inside it. And Let's you're not. Get out of here. Okay, we'll get out of here. And you're not dead. That is what I was going to say. You are not dead, so I can't imagine it being entirely pleasant in there. So what are we going to do with a shopping list? Give it to Bosco, perhaps? Do you have any... For the last time ever, you guys, this ain't a store! Encore! No, nah, what's the point? Whee! Hey, monster, I want to show you something. I've seen too much already. Have you really? Have you really? Hey, monster, I want to show you something. I've seen too much already. I mean, there has to be a reason we broke up this party, right? Do you mind if we perform some quick elective surgery? Whatever. I'm just a monster with no soul. Who cares about my feelings? Great, thanks! A fool and his bones are soon parted. I got a rib. Well, there we go. Let us move on. So what is this going to accomplish? What... what happened? Sam turned you back into a cake, but then oh, we... Whatever. Look, Mr. Wizard, thanks for taking all this time to talk to us, but we're not interested. What if you just... The lady said we ain't interested. Then maybe you... I believe the two of us have made ourselves clear. Ah, fine then! That's too good for you just anyway! And stay gone! Looks like you two have learned an important lesson about cooperation. Fine. You going to order something? You can't just offer something, woman. You got to push the specials. I think I can do fine without your input, Grandpa. Oh, you can, can you? Okay. One down, two to go. How's it going, Stinkies? Just fantastic! Nothing brings in the hip, young clientele like a crotchety, centuries-old, tattooed, hairy man. Well, why don't you have another trivia contest? There's a fresh and original idea. Are you gonna stick around, Grandpa Stinky? Of course. Stinky's cuisine is in my blood. And vice versa. With my cooking skills and her taste for decor, will make this the most horrible dining experience known to creation! Well, you do that and you'll definitely wind up on TV. What is that show called? I can't remember. Glad to see you two are back and working together again. Coots! Troll up! Stay strong, Stinky. Let's do this again. I'm pretty sure she's already read it. So, Stinky, why have you been lying to us all this time? What? I've never lied about anything. Specs gave me the answers to that trivia contest. Do you mean to tell me Herbert Hoover really was president? Nah, we meant all that bunk about your history. You never told us you were a golem made from cake and fish sticks. She doesn't know, lads. And let's keep that our secret. 
Well then, it's a good thing she wasn't paying attention when we said that. And no, Maddie, I don't mean cooking without looking. I mean like real TV. There's uh, there's a show where they go around looking at awful restaurants. Must look at decor. Nope, that still doesn't do anything. Anything else, Max? Now that the stinkies are working together, I wonder if the food here will improve. Nah, but now they can gang up on any food critics or health inspectors. Maddie says kitchen nightmares. Maybe. Maybe. Did you remember to bring your frequent diner's card, Max? What's the point? I've been waiting since Christmas just to get some service. Boy, Stinky sure is a masson. Oh, that's a different. That's the same one we saw before. Get thee behind me. I. All right, so one down. Now, there's also the question of music. Well, we do have a paperclip chain. I don't know if that's going to be useful for creating music, but it's something to try. Though I will save just in case. Just in case I have to change the volume or something. It's funny to think that that train station has been ru Who knew yeah. we were so... Yeah, yeah. Okay, so... Not happening. Nope. Neither of those go to him. The fact that he keeps standing in front of Specs makes me think that I'm not probably going to give anything to Specs. Now one would think that these items that I got from the from Satan is actually gonna be useful. Nah. For something. No way. It's a question of what. I have the strangest desire to go fishing. Fishing? Fishing? I wouldn't have thought of that. Nothing doing. Well then, let's head down there. I don't know what we're fishing for, but now that I know we want to try possibly fishing, and he was constantly mentioning down here, is there anything we can like try to fish for down here? Let's use the... Oh, come on. Why does that keep happening? Nope. Happening. Let's get out of here. No siree. Let's get out of here. You keep saying to get out of here. But you also keep pointing me here in the first place. Maybe the crack in the ground? Because we can, for some reason, suddenly interact with that crack in the ground. We haven't been able to the entirety of the rest of the season. It's also possible that we'll want some string first. But, but then again, maybe not because this is a paperclip chain. Steady, steady, watch the hands. No, don't drop it! Oh, for the love of God, don't drop it! Easy, easy now! You can do this, Sam! I believe in you! Steady, steady! Good hands! Give me the old one, too! It's so close I can taste it! Easy! Shut up, Max! <laughs> hey, we got a thing! <laughs> Back to two pages again. Mime sweeper, huh? Okay, sure. An old mime sweeper cartridge. That seems like it. Oh, don't, before you go too far, let's make sure we don't put the camera where it'll be unfortunate. <laughs> Blows in it. Make sure you read the license agreement first, Sam. It's very important. Just start playing. Ha! Beat that! Bravissimo! 
I think I saw the face of God. You've got to admit it, Specs. <laughs> you just got served like baked ziti at a mafia wedding. I don't know what that means, but I don't care. You will pay for this, Salmon Max. <laughs> don't be sad. What would you do with a golden fiddle anyway? When this case is over, Max and I'll come back to teach you guys about bling. Cool. Two down. One to go. I would like to thank my patrons for being my patrons, including my special sponsor, Lit Dragon. Anyway, we will definitely, most certainly, hopefully, finish Season 2 in the next stream. With that said, I will see you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching.